Hey guys, Shungni here. In this video, I want to talk about combining the Rode Wireless Go with a recorder. You might think uh, putting a recorder on top of your camera with like getting the sound from the receiver unit and then uh, looping the audio out of the recorder to your camera. However, a lot of people talk about that kind of setup, uh, but I personally don't find that a safe setup because the Rode Wireless Go, even though it is a good wireless receiver, uh, it has also some uh, issues with interference because it is a 2.4G and uh, you have Wi-Fi, Bluetooth and a lot of mobile phones that has like 2.4G. So that can get interference or like the, uh, yeah, that the signal loss or like that uh, there are certain kind of hissing or kind of interfering noise that can happen. However, a safer way to record your audio is to actually have the recorder to be before the transmitter. So I have like the Lavalier Go going into the Testcam DR05 and then through the headphone out to the transmitter of the Rode Wireless Go. And then only on top of my camera, I have the receiver of the Rode Wireless Go. This gives me a much more secure feel also because if there's anything that's going to happen with the wireless go, if there's an inter interference or that the signal gets lost, I'm pretty sure that the DR05 or any small recorder uh, will still record the audio. And basically uh, what the receiver unit for me would be like, it's an, uh, recording like an extra sound directly into the camera, but also that I can monitor the sound that is being recorded with uh, or being recorded from a distance that I can actually monitor the sound. So basically this headphone is directly now recorded or directly connected to my uh, Panasonic GH5 here and uh, I can directly listen to the audio that is now coming uh, out of the GH5 but uh, basically it's the audio that is from here. So yeah that gives me like a more secure feeling that the recorder is going to record a sound that won't get any issue of like wireless interference and uh, also a added benefit of this is that the uh, recorder of course can give the uh, wireless go a better audio setting because that of course with a recorder like the dr05 dr10 or like from zoom you have like a lot of the audio settings that are uh, more better to get like a more proper audio because like the Rode Wireless Go only have like um, a few audio settings like just like uh, free volume settings while with the uh, yeah with a recorder you have like much more uh, settings to get like the audio uh, perfect volume that you need. You might also think that this might be like a big setup having like a big uh, or a recorder with a transmitter but this is still quite a small recorder and of course right now on the market there are many uh, smaller recorders like the DR10 or even like the Zoom F1 which are like smaller recorders that are uh, that you can put on a person like a transmitter so yeah right now this uh, for me feels like a more secured setup to use on like uh, interviews or like uh, on weddings that you have this on the groom or bride. So you might think how would this uh, fit onto a person, especially a girl or uh, for a wedding, how would this fit under a dress? So this would actually fit inside like uh, you have now uh, for running certain waist bags where you can put your phone in and this would fit there in there quite nicely with the wireless go and um, also uh, hide the weight quite well all around the waist uh, of the person so this would fit in there quite nicely so my personal conclusion is this is a really nice secured way to record audio having a actual recorder before going to a wireless signal because wireless is still something that is not 100% secured because it can have interference, it can lose signal and, and everything else uh, that could happen. But a recorder would always keep on recording even if it loses the wireless signal. So hope you guys found this a very nice tip and if there's any questions, please comment it below. And if you want to see more videos like this, make sure to hit that subscribe button here below. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.